Hey y'all, this is the Tarot Queen Jamila. I'm here to do the Green Moon Money Reading for the Aquarius. It's going to be for the last half of April of 2016. And it's going to be a five card spread just to look at your money situation. Oops, still got my cards laid out. Alright, so I'm just going to shuffle and we're going to take a look at the Aquarius. We want to know... Um, <clears throat> The Aquarius's current financial situation. Will money be coming into the Aquarius's life very soon? Which money opportunities should you consider more closely? And then who or what project will bring in more money and also a final outcome? So there's a lot of people in your reading, Aquarius, as far as your money is concerned. So there's too many people with their hands on your money, okay? Um, first card you got is the Page of Pentacles, okay? Which means that you're receiving some sort of messages about money, maybe from someone younger than you. Um, some of you may be bored on your job this could represent you literally so this card rep this could this card could represent boredom and restlessness um this can indicate that you're overwhelmed with too much work and you need to slow down and then this is actually a good card because it reminds you of the rewards for good old-fashioned work okay card number two is will money be coming into your life very soon and i did get the king of cups so again this is another literal person so there's somebody that's going to contact you they might even be of some of they might even be able to give you some advice about how to um go about you know, obtaining money and wealth. But I'd say this is a yes card. So there's definitely some money coming up very soon for your Aquariuses, okay? Um, card number three, you got the King of Pentacles. So this is another literal person. He's very good with money. He knows how to manifest money. That was pretty much it that I could say. Oh, yeah, that's what it was. Um, money opportunities that you may want to wish more more closely. So there's a man. Um, I can see him offering some sort of business opportunity to you or either inspiring it. Okay. Um, what you should get into. I would say, you know, if you're planning on going back to school, maybe go, you know, for, to law school. I can sense that some of you Aquariuses are researching that as well as, you know, the, as well as spirituality, okay? Card number four is who or what project will bring in more money? And you got the Six of Swords, okay? Which means that there is a project being offered to you. There's some sort of offer being made to you to travel. Um, it pretty much means this is metaphorical movement and very fast. So I would say that whatever it is, um, it's definitely going to be something that you have to travel to when I see this card. Um, your final outcome is the Ten of Swords.
So I do see some sort of emotional torment. Some sort of breakdown, some sort of betrayal is what I see within this card as far as with money. Um, you know, this card comes with some sort of, you know, wisdom with it as far as to how to handle it. So you are going to handle some adversity. Somebody's going to tear you down and try to tell you that you're, you know, whatever. Um, so it is an unpleasant condition. Things may be rough. The Ten of Swords is about trust. Trust in yourself and trust in other people. So you may want to go ahead and, and trust someone. Okay, give them the opportunity to, you know, guide you mentally. Um, this card can also mean that you may leave your job, okay? Um, for a more in-depth personal reading, contact me on my website. Um, make sure you thumbs up this video and subscribe, and I'll see y'all later. Bye.